it. Rah! Give in your garden. Give up. Just chop it down. Just kidding. My name is Gavin, and I'm here to help you out with your mite problem. You have found us on a YouTube channel, or you have just Googled and found this beautiful video. Today, we're going to help you get rid of your mites. So, you have many non-harsh chemical options out there. Please don't go that route. You don't want to eat it. Nobody else wants to deal with it. Not good for anybody. These are just not good for mites. They're good for everything else. You have many options. Many people love different products. Your buddy might like one more than the other. Your call, but here's what we got in the shop every day. My favorite to, to give out to anybody would be Azimax. It is an organic, O-M-R-I listed. It is derived from neem oil. It's just a higher concentration of all the active ingredients that's inside of neem oil. This is going to smother your mites. This is going to make them unhungry and this is going to cause them to not want to do it basically so sexual dysfunction and an anti-feeding yeehaw so this kills in several different ways neem oil is just going to smother mighty wash is going to supposedly rip them apart and explode them that's kind of fun we can get into that later monterey spinosad is going to poison them from the inside it's a slower active uh poison well, it's not really. Well, it is a poison. It's slower active, but it's going to get the job done. Fantastic for later in harvest. This one as well. There's less residues left on. Along with less residues, uh, pyrethrin, a favorite among all gardening enthusiasts. Um, this product is not listed organic, uh, but it is most likely derived from chrysanthemums. It is possible that it's made in a factory, but one way or the other, there is a organic cousin of this and it's hanging out waiting for you. Um, here we have some oil based products or at least two of these. Liquid Ladybug is a peppermint oil and SNS 217 is going to be a rosemary oil. This is one of the few products on the market that's organic and says that it's going to kill the eggs all in one spray. Pretty nice but it's a ready to use so it might cost you a little bit more. Also, there is the safer insect soap. Gotta love the insect soap. Um, I wouldn't recommend using only this, but it does take care of the business. So, here is something to think about. There's no one product that's going to get rid of your mites in one spray. Stop thinking that. It just isn't going to happen. What you're going to need to do, depending on your size of garden, is either, either use this spray bottle this spray bottle, this spray bottle, or something bigger, and you will be applying any of these once every three days for a bare minimum of four sprays. You're in the battle, you want to win, that's how you do it. Another key ingredient in this fight is not just punching with one product, but killing in two ways, or I can't juggle, three ways. Um, this way your pests never get used to the same product that you're using. Just make sure that you're not doing the same products in a row. So Azimax is derived from neem. Using both of these is going to be less effective than using both of these. Take that in. So these products are available at our shop online. Come and check us out. We're in the store. We're here for you when we're open. You can give us a call. I'll talk to you about mixing ratios. It's easy. But your mites are a problem now, but they won't be a problem in your future as long as you use these products correctly. Thank you very much.